Today, I'm cooking spinach tofu soup for dinner. It is simple and very easy to cook, suitable for children and elderly. This recipe is for 4 to 5 servings. The ingredients needed are 200 grams of baby spinach, wash, cut and separated the stems and the leaves, 1 liter of water, 55 grams of fuchok or fried bean curd sheets, 6 pieces of seafood tofu, 200 grams of squid which is optional, it can be substituted with shrimp, minced chicken or pork, 270 grams of silken tofu, 1 tablespoon of cut spring onions, 2 tablespoon of oyster sauce, quarter teaspoon of sesame oil, quarter teaspoon of pepper, and half teaspoon of salt. The full list of the ingredients and the measurements are in the CMO link. Switch on the heat in the pot, add in 1 liter of water, all the pepper, sesame oil, quarter teaspoon of salt, and the oyster sauce. Give it a stir. Cover the pot and bring it to boil. This will take around 5 minutes for the soup to come to a rolling boil. While waiting for soup to boil, cut the fucho to a smaller pieces. Leave it aside. Cut the silken tofu. It can be cut directly on the plate as it is very soft. We will get 9 pieces of the soft tofu. Put it aside. Next, marinate the squid with the balance of salt. Rub until well incorporated. Leave it aside. After 5 minutes, the soup has come to a rolling boil. Add in the spinach stems seafood tofu, and silken tofu. Stir the soup and allow it to come to a rolling boil again. This will take 1 minute. Alright, the soup is boiling now. Add in the squid and give it a stir. Cover the pot for 30 seconds as the squid will cook very quickly in the soup. Try not to cook it too long as it will become very tough. After 30 seconds, open the lid, give it a taste. Delicious! At this stage, more seasoning can be added as preferred, but for this, it's already perfect. Switch off the heat, add in the spinach leaves. Gently stir for the spinach leaf to soften in the hot soup and to prevent the silken tofu from breaking. Alright, the spinach leaves are soft now. Slightly push down the food choke to submerge in the hot soup. Set aside some for later. Cover the pot for 2 minutes to allow the residual heat to cook the spinach leaves and for the food choke to soak up some of the soup. After 2 minutes, the spinach tofu soup is ready. Garnish with some cut spring onions. Let's eat! Oh wow, the soup is very tasty and sweet. Both spinach and the squid are cooked perfectly and the tofu is so smooth. Very delicious soup indeed. Thank you for watching. Please like and share if you have enjoyed this video. This is Home Cooking with Somjit. Thank you and bye-bye.